Hey guys, how are you doing? Great to see you again on In Gear and as usual, we have a jam-packed show just for you. We begin the show with a continuation from last week's segment where we take a look at a couple of very sexy American muscle cars in Pimped. Following that, we have great news for buyers of great imported cars. You can now do stuff to your screen which would previously only show stuff that you cannot use. Well, we've got the product just for you. And finally, a showdown like no other. We pit two of the hottest micro hatches out there. But today is part one, next week is part two. But you know what? Stay on to find out exactly how hot is today's show. All right then, let's get down to business. First up is a continuation of last week's story about this very, very cool Impala with our very own Chip Foos. Well, his name is Hatish Meyer. Let him tell you more about the other car, which is the Rat. Okay, you know, uh, you would expect I would expect the, the, panel, the, the, the meter know, to the go like that. School, yeah, yes, yeah, that's yeah, what yeah. you would expect. Okay, this is a new school. Uh, as you can see, it's all digital. Ah, so this is what you mean by the digital panel. Yes, so everything yes. literally is digital. Yes, it gives you all sorts of information, like uh -huh. a modern car. Okay. But I've not connected it yet. It's still work in progress. Right, 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 right. right. And as you can see, it's voltmeter, fuel, uh, the brakes are on, RPM, speed, whatever. It's <laughs> I all love there. the fact that the fuel comes in percentage, yeah? Yeah, it's all in percentage. Right, right. This is in volts, of course. Right. Really, you and know? then uh, you've hooked up a sound system to it as well. Of course, yeah. it's an American car. Crank it up, man. Crank it up. Okay. This is what it's about, man. Listen to that, 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 that V8 sound. It's distinctive and it's... But yeah, then... you got to go to the back too. To, yeah, yeah, to get the, the, the exhaust yes, note. Yeah, yeah. Yes. But this is only one part of the sound, yeah. then you have the other part which is the sound system, right? Yeah, that's the sound system. Yeah. Um, yeah, I've modern, um, it's actually a modern sound system for the car. Uh -huh. um, if you look at the back, you can see the subwoofers and all that. Right, right, right. So, you want me to crank it up? Or? Yeah, let's crank up the sound system as well and see what you can get. How loud, how loud does it go? No <laughs> Driving with the window down. Amazing, man. That's cool. That's really, really cool. Okay, so well, that's, uh, this is definitely a great work in progress car. Uh, and maybe, maybe you're wondering, you know, what's this metallic surface here? These are, of course, dynamats, and this is to, uh, it's a soundproofing um, uh, material, right? That you yes, put in the car. Uh, dynamat is actually American, mm -hmm. and. Uh, I've been using Dynamat for the last probably seven years. I'm right. a hardened believer in Dynamat. Right. I've right, tried right. many others, I'm um, just not satisfied. Mm -hmm. As you can see, it's all Dynamated, mm -hmm. including the other car. Mm -hmm. It's all Dynamated. And it starts from the firewall, right all to the, the way back, to the back, and the boat and the roof lining, the roof right. area. And this takes away the rattles and the shakes rattles, and it just makes, it yeah. gives you solid sound and right, you, know, right, you right. feel you're not in a rattly old clunker. <laughs> you know, that kind of stuff. Old, but not rattly, yes, not, not clunker. Rattly, okay, you know, so let's go and have a look at this car, man. Let's, uh, yeah. let's have a quick look at this car. Right, so this baby is more of a more of a work in progress compared yeah, to your this, car, right? Yeah, uh, this just came back from the painters last week. Right, customer and car. This yeah, is a customer's this car. is a customer's car, uh -huh. and um, as you can see, um, work is in progress. Mm -hmm. um, it's got about probably six months to nine months to go mm -hmm. before it's fully on the road. Mm -hmm. This is a Chevy Impala, mm -hmm. 1967. So body shell type, it's the same? More or less the same. More or less uh, the some same. changes for the front. Yeah. The front is different, the back is different. Right. <clears throat> and um, this is the one with the big block. Yeah. The 454. So this is the 454. This, this is a car where people just have to move off the road. So if that one makes about 320, this one makes about? 
Oh, this will be close to 600. 600 yeah. horsepower on a steel frame yeah. and body shell and it's, yep. what, four and a half yep. tons? This engine uh, was fully rebuilt and uh, dyno in US. Okay, so we, we kind of like get an idea already of you know what yep. you've done here and what yep. you're going to do here. So tell me, uh, when you're talking about American restoration, yeah? Yes. So the difference between a continental restoration and American restoration yep. is continental, they probably want to go really, really original, all right? Yep. In the American cars, yep. so when you upgrade and all that, um, how much of a leeway do you have to play with stuff? Can you go down the original route or do you have to go? No, with you don't have to go to this road. You can yeah. go down the original route. Uh, that is uh, for those people who really want it original. The yeah. way it came from the factory, yeah. that's the way it should be. Uh, like I said, you know, you have the new generation, the 30-something, yeah. right. right, that are just dying for something old but with new technology. Right, right, right. They want yeah. old clothes, yeah. new new inerts. Yeah. So it's um, basically uh, that generation factor. Mm -hmm. All right. But it's not just in Malaysia. This mm -hmm. is worldwide. Worldwide Out trend, in Australia, eh? yeah. it's the same. You know? Right, right. So the, the other thing you notice in this car, <clears throat> there are no door handles, nothing. No oh, badges, yeah. no chrome. There's no door handle. It's a new look. So how do you open the doors? We'll use remote to open the doors. What if you don't have battery in the remote? Yep, then you stand outside. <laughs> now, that's a safety feature. There is a safety yep, feature. There's a safety uh, feature to it. Okay, okay. So that's yep. why you got to do it with uh, with uh, people who know, like yourselves, yep. Yep. because you will know what will yep. work and what, what will not will work. work. Yeah. It may work for a week, a month. So it's not just about you know going on eBay, finding that car, finding this part, finding that part, no, car no, kit no, installed. No. no, you got to know your you stuff. You have yeah? to have the knowledge. Now, talk about, uh, give me a rough idea of what sort of costs are involved okay and i'm for, looking here for a restoration for, here. we are looking yeah. for restoration yeah. retro and customization yes it averages between 150 to 200,000 ringgit mm -hmm. just for that retro and customizing work yeah we're looking at full complete building of the, the car. full shebang lah, yeah. yeah like what you have seen earlier yeah <clears throat> with the 68 impala yeah and the same thing here with the 67 yes yeah if you are going to that road that's the kind of price you're going to pay mm. And, and it's not like you can take a bank loan, a higher purchase no, loan, this one is really like real It's available cash. in overseas, it's available in Australia yeah. where people actually can get a car loan uh -huh. because once you have spent 200000 and you can certify that you have spent so much, the insurance companies are willing to insure, insure it. it for that value as uh, on a grid value basis. Right, right, right. Unfortunately okay. here... No, we have... Uh, don't have the system. We don't yet. have the structure here. Yeah, yet, yeah? Yep. yeah, but nonetheless, it's not about the systems. It's yep. about the spirit and the soul, yep, man. It's about the spirit. Yeah. You don't have the passion, you just don't get into all this. Atish, yeah. it's been an absolute pleasure talking to you. Thank yes. you so much, Thank you man. so much, Dino. I, I, I feel like I'm talking to, you know, the king himself, Mr. Elvis Presley. <laughs> you know, we have uh, well, uh, Chip Mr. Mayer. Yeah, Chip, yeah, Chip Mayer. <laughs> Chip all right, Mayer, okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. So, now you Thank know, you. if you want to get into American cars, this is the man that you want to look for, right? Yes, okay, man. now we gotta go and chat my my car, you know. Let's go. <laughs>